What is up YouTube and we are back with another Pokemon Scarlet and Violet raid build and in this video we are looking at another type of Clod Sire. I've already shown you guys a Grass Terra Clod Sire. This one's going to be a Ground Terra. Not too much has changed here so obviously we're still running the Shell Bell to get back our health whenever we take damage. We are a Ground Terra. As far as the move set, we still have Curse and Recover here from the previous build, but we're going with a Ground Terra, so we're going to be using Earthquake to deal a ton of damage, as well as Rock and Sludge Wave there to build up our Trasalization. We are going with 252 HP and Attack with an Impish Nature, so that's going to be increased defense at the cost of Special Attack. Since we're not using Special Attack, it doesn't matter there. Our ability is Water Absorb. You can go into defense and attack instead of hp or defense and hp it's up to you i think this should work just fine with hp and attack which means we'll do a little bit more damage and maybe take less earthquakes to take it out but we're gonna go ahead and bring this in to the raid and uh, see how it goes again we're doing this solo all right so here we are challenging the pikachu solo with our claude sire if you guys do find this video informative or helpful do consider leaving it a like and perhaps subscribing to the channel. We are growing very rapidly. We've got over about 50 subscribers in the last couple of days, and we are on the road to 500. So if you guys would mind helping out there and you guys enjoy this kind of content, I try to keep it as uh, quick and informative as possible with as little fluff uh, as I can. So here we go. We are starting off here against Pikachu. So again, it's not gonna be able to hit us with any of the water moves or any of the electric moves. The only thing we gotta worry about is the Play Rough and the Iron Tail. And Play Roughs will do more damage than the Iron Tail, so it's probably gonna be using uh, Play Rough more often than anything. We always have Recover, so we can uh, heal up if we need to. All right, so there we go, does nothing. It's the allies. Boom, okay, cool, everybody survives. Nice. All right, we're gonna go ahead and start using Curse here. So we're gonna do it. Uh, we're gonna do it three or four times. I don't need to go all the way up to five or six, but uh, we'll see. So here we go. There's the first Curse. We're gonna bring down our speed. Doesn't matter. Pikachu outspeeds us anyways. No matter what we do, we're going to go ahead and get our defense and our attack stat up. Let's go ahead and do this again. We're just gonna lose NPCs left, right, and center, but that's just kind of part of it. Yeah, that did nothing. Beautiful. Okay. There's a another Curse. And we're just going to keep going. Let me know down below how you guys have been enjoying the raid. Of course, it's uh, not going to be available for another couple weeks after I upload this video. But you can always do the little trick to... A uh, little time skip trick to uh, make the system think that it's a new day. And as long as you haven't reconnected since the raid went down, you can continue to do it. As I am here, the event's already over. But as you can see, I am still battling the Pikachu. Uh, I've got a video on how you can do it if you want uh, to see it. It's in the tips and tricks section or playlist but uh most of you guys probably already know how to do this by now is it's very common strategy but you can keep doing the pikachu if you want keep farming those uh those candies those exhale candies those large candies uh, i'm actually maxed out on large candies so i gotta gotta start spending them we're gonna go ahead and here go with a sludge wave we're gonna see how much just three curses do so sludge wave hit him there there we go thank you pikachu gonna do his little pika pika thing going to clear all negative stats on him, which is fine because we didn't do anything to him. Or at least any negative stats. That gives another play rough. We're going to sludge wave again. You can use any move. Uh, I just use sludge wave because it's in its learn pool and uh, it just needs something that can do some damage. So there it is. The rain is now up and we're going to go ahead and boom. Hit him there. Now can we Terra or not? Nope, still can't Terra. All right, let's go ahead and hit him with one more. Should be all that we need so we can terrestrialize. This raid really isn't that bad. Uh, there's lots of ways you can solo it. Lots of great uh, team strats. So I've already got a video up on a Grass Terra Claude Sire, uh, as well as a Lorantis and Appleton. We've got videos coming out for Arboliva and Leafeon. So all kinds of setups um, that work depending on you know on your your taste, your preference, and uh, see what you guys like. Let's see how it goes. Okay, so the player up there. We'll do a little bit of damage, really. We're gonna go ahead and hit it here with an earthquake. Let's see how much this does, actually, because I usually like to go up with six curses, but uh, I think this is fine. Do we not have the shell bell on this thing? Uh, weird. So I may have made the mistake and not had the shell bell on, guys. Uh, we're gonna see. 
I mean, even then, you guys can see that it still works. Obviously, you'd like to have some of that uh, health regen, but we can recover. It seems like it's just my bad. I Yeah, I remember, I think I uh, removed its item and didn't put it back on. I was playing around with the build, but uh, that's fine. We still have plenty of time here. Obviously, definitely recommend you use the shell bell. It's going to go ahead and remove any negative stats on it. We are going to go ahead and recover one tier just to get back that health. And we shouldn't have to heal for the rest of the battle, as this will bring us up quite a bit. So guys, pro tip, uh, don't make the mistake that I made, and make sure that you put the Shell Bell on the Pokemon. But as you can see, I mean, it doesn't matter, we're doing good here. In fact, if you wanted to go more aggressive, you could maybe run like Soft Sand or something like that to increase the, uh, the damage of Earthquake. Because as you can see, we don't really need it. And there we go. So we are caught up with the timer. So we are good to go. I'm gonna go ahead and try to speed through this, guys. I probably won't show too much of uh, the rest of this. I'll just show the attacks and uh, we'll see how it goes. It's bringing down our defense there, but that's fine. Gonna go ahead and do some more damage here. Oh, All right, hopefully we do have enough earthquakes to keep this up. Yeah, we do. We got, we got 11 more. Should take us only about five or six more. And we'll be good to go. We might have to recover once more here, but uh, let's let's see how uh, how close we get it. Okay, <laughs> definitely the shell belt is a good idea, or even soft sand. Like I said, kind of kind of do it as you like. There's obviously so many different builds that work here. Uh, this is just one of them. We've also got a Miascarada build coming out. Basically, this whole week we're just gonna have options that you guys can use against Pikachu, and because these are designed to solo or you know take down seven star raids the team they are great options for soloing six star raids uh, making five stars trivial so you don't really have to think about that this can take down six star raids incredibly easily given most of those don't have you know the shield pop up right away there's no gimmicks nobody's holding a light ball stuff like that okay and we are i think we're two hits away from finishing them off here so of course you can use curse more Maybe uh, reduce the amount of times you have to use Earthquake. Uh, it's all about pacing and all about how you uh, how you want to do it. Oh, we got some... Uh, got the uh, water absorber there. All right, fantastic. All right, and here we go. This should be a GG to the Pikachu. All right, fantastic. There it is, guys. So you can see another build that is perfect for taking down Pikachu. Guys liked it, like the video. If you loved it, consider subscribing. Check out my other tips, tricks, raid builds, and VGC content on the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next video.